All right, we're leaving Lyon, and it was a great, great stay, and uh, we're on our way to San Martin. Yep. Uh, this morning was more crowded than leaving many other cities, not just because it was Lyon, but probably because a lot of people choose to start in Lyon. There is about two groups of, like, seven or eight pilgrims that we competed with the whole day, but... It kind of just shows you, we talk about it a little bit later too, detailing how we're having to watch out for more and more people, and uh, it's like... And the know. hotels, albergues, hostels, and pensions are filling up. Very fast. It's getting very difficult to find places. Yeah. So, um, wish us luck in that aspect. We're having fun. That's the weary pilgrim. That's how I feel most days. Just want to crash on a bench or someplace because my legs are killing me. I love these statues. I say statues, but it was part of a, a building. Um, just really awesome artwork. Just, you know, for hundreds and hundreds of years, these have been there. Just amazing to me. Right, Alex, we are uh, taking off this morning out of Lyon. You have a good night last night? Yep, uh, I did. I did. It was a wonderful night's nice sleep in a great apartment. All right, I'm just showing the river here as we walk out of town, taking a lot of pictures. Alex is a little annoyed because I'm going slow. Sorry. Maybe one day he'll appreciate all this footage that we're taking, photos, these old Roman bridges, just gorgeous. Leaving the city of Lyon as the sun comes up. And uh, we get about 15 to 17 mile hike today. So we got to get on it, get after it. And there he goes. Okay, a little bit different uh, today. We're hiking into, uh, out of Lyon and into the next town, San Martin. And there's Alex. And showing you the canal that kind of more like an irrigation system. They have all these irrigation, old concrete irrigation systems for miles and miles. Uh, to the left, there's some Spanish corn. Shout out to our corn lady in, in heaven there, uh, Scott Harris's corn shop, corn stand in uh, Marblehead, Danbury Lakeside, Ohio. Uh, the Spanish corn is high, but they don't have as many uh corns in the stalk as good old scott harris does so and i'm not sure it can be quite as sweet either anyway we're right next to the road you can hear all the traffic passing us the other interesting thing we found today was as we get closer and closer to our objective here goes a biker uh there are more and more people on the path bikes pilgrims um, a lot of folks start the hike uh, starting in leon or even closer in as we get closer to San Domingo. Uh, so that's just something we can expect. At least we can see Santiago. the hills we're gonna have to climb, the, the mountains in the distance. That's true. Um, but there are a lot of people, it's getting kind of crazy. You have to get over or pass people about every two minutes. It's, uh, I wouldn't say annoying, it's just something you have to factor in. It's different. Uh, but again, they're all headed to Santiago de Compostela, just like we are. Uh, you start wherever you want, unless you want to say you did the whole whole stage, the whole thing. So, which we will be able to say, thankfully. Anyway, may edit some of this. Just wanted to show you a variety and uh, what we're dealing with today. All good. About seven more K before we get there. <laughs> 